Kidney disease is a serious health concern for all Australians. Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people experience a greater burden of kidney disease than other Australians. In the 2012-13 National Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Health Measure Survey, 18% of adults had signs of chronic kidney disease. Levels were similar for men and women and levels increased with age. CKD often goes undiagnosed and many people with signs of CKD were not aware that they may have the condition. In 2018 to 19, just under 2% of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people self-reported having kidney disease. It was found to be most common in the Northern Territory, followed by Western Australia. Importantly, kidney disease is more common among Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people living in remote and very remote parts of Australia. Dialysis treatment for kidney disease accounts for almost half of all hospital admissions for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people. The good news is that if kidney disease is detected early enough, its progress can be slowed or even stopped. There is an increasing focus on factors that can help to address kidney disease among Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people. These include making sure that patients, their families and communities are actively involved in designing services, research and policy, increasing access to treatment like dialysis and transplantation and helping patients to get their treatment closer to home improving cultural awareness and addressing racism and bias in the healthcare system, increasing the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander health workforce, and providing care that is holistic and appropriate. By working together in partnership, improvements can be made to address kidney disease. For more information, visit our website.